take us inside. Let's look at the uh, comfort zone. Yeah, we've got an air actuated door. Through an air button here. All right. Let me get her lit up here. We have two packages. We have the regular straight panel mm -hmm. cabinetry, mm -hmm. and then what we call this is our GT. Uh, raised panel wood package. Right. Uh, it's available on all the GTs. This is uh, satin cherry mm -hmm. uh, raised panel. Right. Uh, if you notice all the, the at the bottom of each cabinet, it, it looks like furniture. We essentially put legs on the bottom of the cabinets to give it that home furniture feel. Very detailed cabinetry with the, the crown molding on the edge of the cabinets. If you look at the valence up along the top here, uh, that's where your air conditioning discharges and that's crown molding like you'd find in your house. Right. You um, recessed lighting behind there. Uh, yes, rope lighting, mm -hmm. LED lighting that's uh, dimmable mm -hmm. in, in both the salon and the galley. Nice uh, uh, bows that Mm -hmm. Surround sound speaker system. Yes, we've been uh, using Bose throughout all our boats now. Uh, it's it's a great system. It's simple. It's serviceable. Uh, people can understand it right out of the box. Mm -hmm. uh, some of the systems we do put in boats are uh, hundreds of thousands of dollars, and and they you can do anything you want with them. But yeah. they but they get you know somebody that gets a system like that is typically very AV savvy, right. and and most of us are not. Right. And uh, so a Bose system is very simple very good quality system and it, it's easy to service. Another thing you'll notice is the salon sofa. It looks like a sofa you'd find in your house. Yeah. It doesn't look like something that was built just to go on a boat. It doesn't have any square edges. So this is this is a nice leather sofa uh, with the details of a, of a piece of furniture you'd find in your house. Yeah. Very comfortable. Um, very comfortable. It's got storage underneath. Mm -hmm. uh, it's, it's completely open underneath for storage. Uh, another thing you'll notice inside the salon is there's no blinds. Mm -hmm. nice. uh, Twofold, one, it makes it seem a lot bigger, mm -hmm. and it does. Uh, we've done one with the blinds in it, and it's noticeably different right. feel inside the salon. So what we do is we double tint the salon windows. Um, at night, you can turn every light on in the boat. Nobody can see in. Wow. It helps reduce the heat. Right. It gives you privacy, but it allows you to have an open, airy feel in the salon. And what we call this is about our 270 degree view. Right. If you notice as you shoot, there's nothing above waist height mm -hmm. in the salon to obstruct your view looking outside the boat, except for obviously the the forward end of the galley, yeah. which you just can't do anything about. And I guess you save a little, a little energy on your um, air conditioning because it's uh, the sun Correct. is reflective. Oh, yes. Yeah. Yes. That's fantastic. Um, Let's check the galley. Yeah, the galley's got granite countertops. Those are optional. You've got six six banks of food storage. You've got on this side, you've got a refrigerator freezer unit, top drawer refrigerator, bottom drawer a freezer unit, and then over directly right here, you've got drawer units that are refrigerator on top or no this one's this one on this boat is this is refrigerator that's freezer this is all refrigerator wow, so tons you've, got, of refrigerator you've space. got tons of refrigeration space yeah. um, nice that's freezer that, that one's freezer it's fantastic um, and the bar stools are standard as well those two bar stools on uh, this side, uh, you've got your sink with storage underneath. Garbage disposal. Garbage and a garbage disposal, standard. Mm -hmm. uh, this one has a built-in built uh, soap dispenser. Uh, does, does the garbage disposal also double as a uh, as a chum? Uh, yes, you can, you can. <laughs> if fishing slow, you're you're capable of bringing in ballyhoo and dropping them right down there. And, and it, just as long as you you got to set the water right so that it flows out in, in, in good right. time. So, but uh, but yes, and then you could also put minhaden oil in here yeah. and help supplement the That's the right. uh, the chum slick with uh, right. from the galley. Uh, then you've got uh, silverware. Uh, um, nice forks, uh, cooking utensils, storage here, and a big storage cabinet right here, which we've uh, 
on some boats we've taken the shelf out made it smaller and put a uh, trash bin on a uh, trash can on a uh, yeah, sliding yeah. rolling right. rack mm -hmm. that's nice obviously this is a long deep cabinet and what we do is we put a oh, yeah. pull out shelf that'll house everything and you can obviously see what you've got here so if you're standing here cooking you've got your spices whatnot sure. you can just access it very easily yeah, that's and nice and then if we pull on both sides on that one. Oh yeah. And up here, oh, yeah. we've got the microwave hidden. Mm -hmm. um, it's a convection microwave as well. Uh, your range top, now what's unique, again, I'll go back to Hatters is very safety oriented like most manufacturers. Mm -hmm. uh, if you notice here on the screen for the microwave, it's not lit up. Mm -hmm. If I push it back and lock it in place, it allows the power to go to this unit as well as the range top. Right. So if you're underway and somebody happens to come through here and you bump a wave and they happen to turn a dial, this will not turn on. This has to be open. This has There's to be open and locked in that. place. That's fantastic. Um, yeah. Right on the uh, dinette side, again, we've got storage, three banks of storage on this side as well. There's another bank yeah. right here. Um, We've had people put racks in here for wine glasses, for uh, uh, cocktail glasses. Sure. Uh, so. Electrical equipment uh, for mm -hmm. the big AV systems. This is really nicely laid out. You got the. Yes, and the dinette, uh, dinette, again, when I brought up that we uh, did mock ups for the GT. Uh, we mocked up this dinette and optimized the spacing to see how many people we can fit around this mm -hmm. table. So it's a five person table, four, mm -hmm. four person on a very comfortable scale, mm -hmm. five, five people can fit in. Mm -hmm. And then you got the bar stools as well. Right. Uh, but again, the, and the couch. Yeah, and the couch. So yeah. with a table with storage underneath it as well. I was going to ask that because I saw that table once. Every other tabletop has storage. I figured you had storage yeah, under that table. Yeah, if you just pick up right here in the corner. Uh, over here you've got an ice maker for drinks, uh, your TV, your switching panel, which has got a uh, monitoring system, uh, the same system that is actually used by the Navy. The screen and the system uh, was designed for the Navy by a company. Um, what that system does is when you plug into shore power, it actually runs through a self-check and does not let the power into the boat unless it checks out okay. If it doesn't check out okay, it's gonna tell you and it, you're gonna say, okay, well, it's something on the dock, it's something on the pedestal, my shore cord's got a nick in it and mm -hmm. I've, got, I've got a bad cord. Uh, but it's, it's very foolproof, it, it, it really protects the boat. Right. All here are easily accessible. Easily accessible. Yeah, that's great. Right. And what's nice is you can come in here, if you've got your shoes on and it's raining out and you're getting ready to take off in the dock, one step and you're right here, you're not tracking through the whole salon. It's right. back here in the back. Right.